I adopted Beth? Yes. No. That's Phoebe. She's Phoebe. I know it's hard to take in, and it's a shock, but it's true. You've been raising my daughter. All this time, hope was in mourning, and your son knew. We don't know that. Rich, why would they lie? All they do is lie. He married Hope knowing we'll that... De we'll deal with Thomas. We'll talk to him. Right now, I'm concerned about Steffi. There's a lot of pain coming her way, and she doesn't deserve it. Sally, I have to say, the changes you made in this design, uh, they, they go way above and beyond what I asked you to do. Yeah, I, I wasn't actually sure if I went too far with you telling me to dig into my inner spectra. Mm -hmm. um, but, I mean, you said you wanted something daring. Yeah, well, daring, yes, but I wanted you to stay within the original intent of the design, and uh, that's exactly what you've done. And I held a lot faster than I expected. This is terrific. What a wonderful job. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. You've really been throwing yourself into your work lately, haven't you? Yeah. It's been a nice distraction, given my social life is coming to a screeching halt. Well, whatever the reason, you're a valuable asset to this company, I'll tell you that. Thank you. Praise from Eric Forrester. I should go through breakups more often. You don't have to pretend it doesn't hurt. I can see how much you miss Wyatt. I can see how much you still love him. For what it's worth, I'm sorry that you and Wyatt didn't work it out. Yeah, well... Who needs a man when you got designing to do, right? There are worse things than work to immerse yourself in after a breakup. <sighs> yeah, well, don't get me wrong. I definitely spent way too much of my paycheck at Bikini those first couple of days. But, you know, drowning your sorrows gets old after a while. Wallowing really isn't a part of my personality. No, it's not. You have way too much talent to waste on that sort of thing. Too much talent and beauty and just about the right amount of your namesake's flair. You know, I should have you write my online dating profile. Well, paper and pencil, let's get started. Look, online or not, some, some lucky guy is gonna, he's gonna observe all those wonderful qualities in you. I just, I wish it had been Wyatt. Rich, we will be there for Steffi. Okay, I know this is gonna be difficult for her. If, if I could go back and do all of this again, I, I would. What, what, what would you do? You'd stop stealing other people's babies and selling them? Now stop a second. Flo did not do that. You put a baby that didn't belong to you into my daughter's arms and made her raise it as her own. And with all your explanations, that's wrong. You understand that, right? You're messing with people's lives. Steffi, Hope. I know this is what you wanted, the miracle you've been waiting for, and I'm happy for you. I'm, I'm trying to be happy for you and hope. But what about Steffi? It's not fair. We can, um, we can do whatever genetic tests need to be done, but people involved have already admitted what happened. Gambling debts? Zoe's dad owed money. And he decided that selling a baby was a fast way to make some cash. It's not your mom's fault. He just knew that she was ready and willing to hand over any amount. That man... He took someone else's child, a, a dead child, and he put it in our arms. 
And he told us it was Beth. He brought her to me. He lied to me. And we grieved her. But the truth is, she was thriving because she was here the whole time with you and Kelly. Safe and loved and cared for. Yeah, you got a minute? What? Eric said you'd be in here. What's going on? Um, something happened. Uh, something good or something bad? I mean, a lot of both, I guess. Okay, what is it? I will make you pay for this. I promise you. We're gonna go see our kids. Yes, we are. Our driver's license? Oh, I have them right here. You're not actually gonna keep them, are you? Oh, God, no. Eventually, we're gonna hand them over to the police. I have given up on miracles. I mean, how could something like this happen? But it did. We have our bath. She's back. <laughs> Never letting you go. Never again. I mean, it, it does explain the near instant connection we both felt to her. From the first moment we saw her, I remember holding her. It was like this jolt went through me. Because you knew, didn't you? The way you crawled up to me at that wedding and you called me mama. You were just trying to find your way back to me, weren't you? Yeah, I love you so much. I can't wait to take you home. No, you're not. Oh. That's... That's Phoebe. little girl I've been raising. She's the little girl I brought into my family so Kelly can have a little sister. You're not taking Phoebe anywhere. You're not taking my daughter from the only home she's ever known. Wyatt, what is it? It's just, it's a, it's a long story, and uh, it, uh, people just, they aren't what they seem sometimes. People meaning flow? Uh, what did she do? You can't just take Phoebe away from me. Her life is here, with her sister, with her mom, and that's me. I'm her mommy. We, we can figure this out. We can figure it out. We can figure out why we just have to, we have to do it reasonably. Steffi. Steffi, my daughter was stolen from me. You proposed killing mine? Just, just to take a, can we take a breath for a second? This is not. No. This is not easy or straightforward, but... but Baby is staying here. Steffi, I am so grateful to you and to all the care that you've given her, but she needs... Beth needs to come with me. What about... What about fighting for her family? And putting the children first? That's what we're doing, right? How are you just going to yank Phoebe away from me? It's wrong. What's wrong is her being a... Pet. 
apart from her mother for months. I know, I know what you've been through, but we, we have to think about Phoebe, please. Beth. Her name is Beth. And I am thinking about her. She needs to be with me. I have a lot of lost time to make up for here, but Steffi, Steffi, I'm not trying to erase you. I would never, ever do that. Do you understand me? You can be as involved as, as much as you want. Okay, you, can, you can help with the transition. Transition? Transition? I haven't just been her babysitter, I'm her mom. You are not her babysitter and I am not your surrogate. So where does that leave us? I don't know. I don't know. All I know is that I love her. <laughs> and Kelly loves her. Steffi, Steffi, there's still sisters. No, they, they always no. will be. Phoebe needs to be raised in this Beth. home. Her name is Beth. I know you're going through hell, but you have to understand hope. What you're asking of me? I'm not asking. Liam. We were like a family. And now you're just walking away? Say something. For once, say something. Tell her she's wrong. Tell her not to take my baby. Uh, Hope and I are her parents. And we thought that she was gone. We thought that she was dead and she's not. She's here and that's, <clears throat> that's amazing. But I, I don't want to do this to you. I don't want to do this to you. So. If anybody is going to be sensitive to what it's like to have your kid taken away from you, it's hoping me. So we're not going to do that. We're not going to let that happen, okay? We can work something out, right? We, we, can, f we can find a, a, yes. a solution. Liam, a but it's time for her to be Beth again. my daughter home. So this has to do with Flo? Did she do something? Look, before I get into all that, I just, I need to apologize. Why? Just, I mean, the way we ended things. Look, why you have nothing to apologize for, okay? I, I betrayed your trust, I kept a secret from you, and I regret it. Yeah, but I was upset, all right? I, I just, I don't, I don't like secrets. And the fact that you were keeping one for Thomas, of all people, and that it was hurting my brother. <sighs> it was a mistake. No, people make mistakes. I just, I'm, I'm saying that now that I look back on it, and yours really wasn't, wasn't that bad. What are you saying? Look, there's a lot of crazy stuff happening right now, and, and I will explain all of that to you. I just, I want you to know that I was wrong. I, I regret the way that I ended things with us, and I'm just, I'm sorry. <sighs> okay, I'm confused. What happened to high school sweethearts reunited? That's not happening. So this is what? You crawling back to me? I just want you to know that through all the madness that's going on, I couldn't think of anything more important than seeing you. 
I'm sure you guys have questions. Yes, we were just with Flo and her mother. And Zoe. They filled us in. It's, it's unbelievable what they did. I, for one, am happy that the truth came out. And I'm so happy for you, my sweetheart. You have your precious little girl back. And your family with Liam. I'm sure you're excited to take her home. It's not happening. What do you mean it's not happening? You, you can't just take away the baby I adopted. There was nothing legal about that adoption. Do you think Phoebe knows that? All she knows is me. She doesn't know she was stolen. She knows her sister. She knows this house. Okay, and as Liam's daughter, she will continue to know this house and, of course, to spend time with you, but she's not going to be like Can you just give her a moment to adjust? Can you do that? Rich, a baby was stolen, and it needs to be given back. I mean, you must understand that, Debbie. What we need, we need to think about what's best for... It can't be just ripping her away from the only family she knows. Okay, so what are you suggesting? <laughs> this is Beth. Beth. You gave birth to her. My mind is starting to catch up with me. Just, could you just listen to me? You, you can be kind of a mother to her. You, you could keep her here without uprooting her from her family. Oh my God, Steph, you can't be serious. All she's saying is that this has been a blow for all of us. <laughs> and the baby's happy, and healthy, and and thriving here. I am extremely grateful for everything that you have done, Steffi, but it is time for Beth to go home. And none of us expected this, and yet here we are. And I have been given the impossible, a second chance with my child that I was told was dead after months of grief and sadness, and you think I'm walking out of here without her? No, oh, she's exactly right where she belongs. Where she should have been since the day she was born. I am so thankful for the care you have given her all this time. But Steffi, my daughter, is finally in my arms again. And I am not letting her go. I'm taking my daughter and don't you dare try to stop.